What's up guys, MFG back with another uh, review for you today. Um, today I've uh, got a cheapie that I found at Ross for eight bucks. I know it's, it's hard to find a fragrance for eight dollars these days, but that's how much I paid for it. Um, this is a uh, kind of a quick uh, grab and spray fragrance, you know, just to head out. Uh, I think mostly for um, like a date night or maybe in the fall time for this one. Um, uh, original Penguin Rocks. Um, it was launched in 2012. Let's look at the box first. It's a real like a plain box. Um, it's a eau de toilette 3.4. Um, with some information on the bottom, here's your batch code. Um, says the original penguin may have made its mark in the 1950s, but continues to live on today. Rocks and aromatic woody oriental fragrance is the perfect blend of heritage with while well, wit and innovation my bad um yeah it's kind of messed up but well for, for eight dollars I, I mean you don't really get it for the box so there's the box here's the fragrance a very thin looking bottle um it's hard to put any other other my fragrances like next to it because it's so wide um, but yeah, here's that on the bottom. It's got your batch code, your little penguin guy on the front. Okay, now this has got a magnet, but it's not a strong one. I mean, it's barely on there, so don't you know go be gra grabbing it by the the cap because you'll drop it. I've <laughs> done that a couple times. I keep forgetting. I mean, that I, it's got a magnet on it, but I've dropped it, but there's your rocks. I'll show you the sprayer. It's a it's, it's a decent sprayer, not you know not the best, but man, the fragrance is pretty nice. It, it's a it smells green, you know, uh, with the green apple, the top notes green apple, bergamot. Uh, the hard notes is lavender, cypress, and clary sage. Base notes tonka bean, white wood, sandalwood, and suede. But yeah, when you first spray it, you get that blast of a uh, green apple and bergamot. Uh, it's kind of a you know a fruity, sweet green, soury, uh, citrusy, bitter tartness um, out, out of the top. Um, and the lavender gives it a, uh, a clean floral. The cypress, dry, woody, and earthy. And the clary sage uh, kind of mixes in with the lavender. It's a soft, uh, soft sweet uh, lavender uh, balsamic smell. And then the tonka bean is kind of a sweet tobacco almond smell. The white wood is just pretty much wood uh, with a smell of kind of a, a vetiver or a patchouli. Uh, and then you get the creamy sandalwood smell and then you get the powdery musk musky smell from the suede but yeah you uh get a moderate projection moderate ci's and a great value if you can pick it up at rock me wherever a rack store is around your house and you see this one pick it up i mean it's around i don't know how mine was eight dollars the other one beside it was like eleven dollars so i seen that and now i was gonna pick them both up but i was like man one for eight one for eleven like no so i just picked up the eight dollar one i think it's around 10 to 12 bucks max um you can't go wrong i mean it's it, it, it lasts a pretty good minute i think maybe on average probably maybe four to six hours um with a moderate projection of maybe an hour i mean it's not too bad it's an average performer but you can't go wrong with the price and uh I, i've always heard that uh the original penguin is a pretty good cheap kind of um, company I mean it, it's not bad at all it's better than some others so um, yeah I like it um, I picked it up um, I think Ross on his channel he 
he had it, so I went and picked it up too. Um, but yeah, I like it. Uh, other than the ball being flat, I mean, I can't do anything about that. But it's a nice fragrance. Um, if you ever uh, go out to a rack store and find it, pick it up. You can't go wrong with it. Um, thanks, guys, for uh, supporting me. Um, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. And uh, I'll be coming out with more reviews, guys. Thank you so much. And always smell great. Peace.